Hey, what's going on everyone? My name's Diversity and welcome back to the channel. I hope you're having a magnificent Saturday afternoon. And if you're new around here, make sure you hit like, subscribe and comment. All free to do. All helps out the channel big time. Aiming for the big 400 by the end of February. I'll tell you what, we've seen so many new faces around here these last few days. Up to about 390 subscribers, guys. We're so close. 10 more in this last week or so of February and we would have done it. We would have beaten the challenge set by myself last month. But today, Saturday afternoon, big game. South End versus Bolton out route. So the Whites versus the Blues. Wow, well, where do we start with this? Big game for both clubs here. We'll start with the Blues today. After last week's impressive result against Cambridge and before that, the win against Newport, Blues are on a bit of a roll at the minute. Hopefully looking to take down another top team today in Bolton. But there are a couple changes today. Dimitri and Reco Hackett for... Reco Hackett, Fairchild, sorry, come in for Aqua and Carl Taylor. Bit of an odd move bringing Dimmy in, I think, again, especially as Carl Taylor was impressive on, what was it, last Saturday. But, hey, it's Mark Mosey think go for it Holmes is on the bench which is brilliant to see love to see Ricky Holmes in blue today bring him on for the final 30 minutes get that assist get that goal or oh, quality no Noel Ranger today though but uh, it was mentioned that he's not up to match fitness yet so we can only wait for that to happen but Blues do need the points though only one point ahead of Barrow need to be picking up big points though as for the visitors Bolton undefeated in the last four games got to say they've turned their form around really well started off the season down with South End near the bottom and have jumped up that table recently but and also, a fun fact, there's been a red card in the last two of those games for Bowen. So, maybe we'll see another one today. I'd love to see one of those. But anyway, they came back from 2-0 down midweek against Mansfield to win 3-2. Ian Everett's men are a strong team to come to Blues Day. Hopefully, we can shut them out and keep it nice and clean. I'll take the draw. The win will be better. We cannot accept a loss today. Come on, you Blues. Bowen attacking here. Marcus Madison, edge of the box. Going for a shot. Straight on. He's going to spilled it. Oh, <gasps> Jesus Christ, you endure, I believe that says missed from inside the six-yard box. Dodgy keeping there by Oxley. Got to say, Marcus Madison original shot, quite a spinner. Oxley spilled it into the box. You and Doyle, less than six yards out, has put it over. Oh, big let off there. Not even ten minutes in, first major chance gone. Oh, shit, shit. One nil, one nil. Offside. Oh, praise the Lord. Bolt would have the ball in the net. But it's offside. Praise the bloody Lord. I think it's Delafonzu with the last touch there. Great pass from Bolton there. Set for, I think it was you and Dorn watching the replay now. Madison, great boy. He's been danger this first couple of minutes. Into Dorn, who slips into the number four. I think that's the West Ham loney. But it is luckily offside there. But oof. Bolton on top of Blues at the moment. Go on, Dimmy. Go on. Reco, put this ball in the box, please. Please do something good. Skin him, skin him. In the box. Good. Head on it. Akinola. Oh, headed out the back. He got on. Oh, no, it was Elvis. Sorry. Elvis got under it instead of heading it towards the goal, and it goes over the bar there. Good play from the Blues, though. Good crossing by Reco. Elvis, unlucky to get under it. Come on, you Blues. Go on, Reco. Bend that. Oh, Baptiste got in the way of that, and it goes into the goalie's gloves there for Bolton. That had curl on it, Reco. Free kick for Bolton here, right on the edge of the Blues box towards the left-hand side. 42 minutes on the clock. Marcus Madison on loan from Charles. Stand over it. Whips the ball into the box. Fast pace. Ooh! Baptiste nearly put that in. Low there. Oxley got down quick and caught that ball. Got to say, great reactions there from Mark Oxley yet again. This game, he's actually been... Well, in fact, sorry, no, not just this game. These last few games, he's been really good in his box, controlling everything, and that was just a good example of that corner now for Bolton. Again, Madison standing over it for the Whites there. Whips into the box, headed out at the front post by Hobson. Still in the box though. Drive around. You and Doyle shot. Oh, what happened there? It was saved off the line there by Elvis. Bolton furious, thinking it's gone across the line, but Elvis has pulled that off the line from Madison, long range shot. Oh, just over the bar there. But holy moly, Elvis has just saved a goal there for Bolton right on half time. Jesus. Final chance of the half here for Bolton. Number 30, playing into the number 20. Edge of the box, into the box, into it. Baptiste is rolled out for a corner to Bolton, I believe. It was right before half time. But no, it's referee, referee's blown it. Okay, half time, out roots all. Nil nil. Blues lucky to be surviving in this game so far. Half time review coming shortly. Half time then, out roots all. South and nil. Bolton nil. Got to say, Bolton, they are the clear winners of that first half there. Even though the score says nil nil, Bolton were all over Blues that first half. One shot cleared off the line. Oxley, the goalkeeper, being called into many good saves there. Defence is just being ripped apart by Madison's through balls. It is a very scary time at this time for the Blues. But, got to say though, results around us are going our way. Barrow are losing currently to Morecambe 1 there, which does increase the gap by, uh, I think it's now two points clear of the relegation zone. And with no Grimsby in action today, 
say that is a mighty saving thing. But no, absolutely poor half. Players really, they're doing all the hard work. They're setting the play up really well for the shot for... Sorry, I'll be more precise. Been setting it up more for Akinola, for Ashley, Nathaniel George, but none of them really going for the shot or having the chance. Want to pass it off and try and walk it into the goal, which ain't working against the two big lumps at the back for Bolton and Baptiste. And yeah, the big six at five defender they have there. But I'm hoping in half time we can just make some sense, Mark Mosley, make some sense of what just happened in that first half. It seems like we're holding out against Bolton. And maybe we should just be going for it a bit more because Bolton at the back, Baptiste has been a bit weak. His, some of his passes have been a bit astray and Blues have been trying to pick up on that. But we need someone alongside Akinola up there to be going through, taking the ball and continuing on. But I'll be taking off Dimitri at half time for sure. Not at his best first half here. Don't want to keep it going like this. Bring on Carl Taylor. You know, against Newport and Cambridge, he was absolutely brilliant for us. He came on. He's just that little bit of pace, that little bit more, let's go forward instead of just sit back, hold the ball and pass it about. Hoping for big things in the second half. I don't mind taking the draw. Bolton, a well-organised team at the end of this first half. But hey, we've ridden our luck. Can it last this long? I don't think so. Come on, you Blues. Come on the second half. Go on, Reco. Reco, send it in. Good cross. Bad post. I can only no. He's missed it. He dove into the ball. It went over him. Gilks, the goalkeeper, came as well. They both missed it and it went out. Akinola. Oh, that was the chance. That was the goal. Go on, Akinola. Oh, you're ref. You're having a laugh. Akinola picked up the ball off the defender. The defenders collapsed like a sack of spuds. And now, free kick to Bolton. He was through. What is this shite? Go on, Dieng. Go on, drive. Good, good, good. Lay it off. Yes, yes, no. Nearly threw that to Ashley in the final George and cleared. First change for the Blues today, and it is a returning face to Roots all. Reco Hackett Fairchild going off. Ricky Holmes coming on for the Blues here. On for his debut, I think it is, actually announced for the senior team. But... Jeez, this is a good thing. We've got the wide player now. This is what is good. I think he's gone straight on to the left-hand side here. And Ashley Nathaniel George on the right. 66 on the clock. Come on, Blues. Go on, Ak, he's done four. He's gone down, ref. Ref, he's done four players. Run possible, been pushed over. And the ref's given a free kick the other way. Jesus, he's bottling it. He is bottling it today. Double change for the Blues here. And a sort of different one, to be fair. Tom Clifford and Nathan Ferguson going off. Oncoming Sam Hart and Emil Aqua. We are going more attacking, which is great to see. Big Aqua coming on probably to go up top with Akinola. And Sam Hart coming on for a, a regular switch with Tom Clifford there. A bit harsh on Clifford. He's been really good these last few games. But hey, Hart deserves his run out here. He needs to show to in these last 13 or so minutes that he is still capable of challenging for the squad here. But hey, eight, well, 18, sorry, 12 minutes to go on the clock. Here. Bolton with the ball here in the Blues box and number 24 lays it back to the number 10 and that's not been cleared properly. What is going on here? What is going on? Oh my god. Oh my god. Number 20 Miller has just scored for Bolton. 1-0 Bolton, 82 on the clock. What? Wait, what? Ref's thinking about this. I, to give a brief explanation, the ball has been shot. It's gone up over the Blues players, think, over the bar and bounced back in. But it's come off the crossbar and he's had an easy shot to put it in. What is going to happen here? Has it actually been given? White has hit it off the number 10 there. It's gone up in the air. Oxley thought it's gone over. He's got to catch. He's come off the bar down and in. I don't know if they're complaining for offside or what it's for. The referee is just jogged away. It's 1-0 Bolton. 82 on the clock. This is... Oh, no. <laughs> We've got about eight minutes to pull something back in this game. Just throw it all on attack now. Bolton are there for the taking. Just go for it. Sam Hart here to take a free kick for the Blues in the bolt and off. Whips it up high into the box. Lots of big bodies up there. White heads in the box. Oh, Aqua! You just had to keep it down and you put it over. You bloody put it over from about six yards out. Hi, we're giving this game away. Full time whistle goes at Roots Hill, South End nil, Bolton nil. Uh, review coming shortly. So full time at Roots Hall then, Bolton 1, South End 0. That's a really hard pill to swallow that game. That was, yeah, those four, the first 45 minutes, I'd understand if we had lost 1-0 and we came out in that second half. Completely rubbish and yeah, I wouldn't be as bad or as like hard felt as I am now. But 
to say we deserve to lose after that second half performance would be a lie in itself. We came out in that second half. I think even Bolton fans could probably agree. We came out blues in the second half and we performed so much better. We were on the press more, going right into the Bolton half. We just... We don't take our chances for enough. I know this is going to be so much abuse at Oxley today. And I'm just, I'm not going to agree with it, to be fair. Yes, it's his fault. We might have conceded. But, and yes, you should play to the whistle. But we should be putting these away up top more than anything. We had Ashley Nathaniel George in the first half, who could have shot when he was open. Then he pulled it back. And then he went for a pass off and said, we need to be doing much better up front. Then we wouldn't have to be relying on clean sheets so much on other teams around us. If we just got... Well, maybe when Niall Ranger is fit, or if we get in Jay Simpson, just up top. Akinola, by himself, it just doesn't work. You know, he gets the chances. He's a hard grafter. His work rate is phenomenal up top against, especially there up against two big lumps. But we need some more up top. We need more firepower because we can't just rely on defence each week to be getting us a point through and through and through. It just won't let us survive. Um, yeah, but to be fair to Bolton... Good team all round, came down obviously with a game plan and in the second half, yes, you could say it was lucky. We did hold you off for a bit, but end of the day, it's the three points that matter, you can't argue that. So Bolton, move up the table, I think they're three points outside the playoffs now. Blues, only one point above that relegation zone. But Wednesday night, I will be back to vlog Southend again. Hopefully you'll be here with me and hopefully we'll see a better result and an all round better morale than those final ten minutes of that game. But... I hope you enjoyed the video. My name's been Diversity. If you're new around here, make sure you hit like, comment, subscribe. We're on the big road of 400. I want you to be one of them. And peace.